We have tried to create one of the hardest serial killer quizzes on the internet. The questions have mixed levels, ranging from easy, to near impossible. The quiz has 150 questions, broken up into 6 different categories. The categories, and criteria are The name game You'll be shown the nicknames, that were given to 20 different serial killers. How many will you recognize? Multiple choice You will be given 20 random questions. There are 4 possible answers, can you pick the right one? Sounds familiar you will hear samples of 20 serial killers' voices. The audio sample will not give away any clues on who they are. Can you identify them purely on the sound of their voices? Who did it? You will be given the name, and photograph, of the victim of a serial killer. Can you match the victim with their killer? Pop culture. You will be shown 20 movies that either directly depict a famous serial killer, or will have a character highly influenced by a real serial killer. Identity Parade You will be shown 30 photographs of different serial killers from around the world. Can you name them all? Who said it? You will see 20 quotes given by serial killers. Can you match the quote to the killer? We ask you do not cheat, although you can. But that would be pretty pointless. We have created a point scale that will rate you depending how many you correctly answered. That scale will appear at the end of the video. So, grab a pen and some paper, and try and recall all the information you saw on the hundreds of serial killer documentaries you've watched on YouTube. Good luck, and let me know where you ranked on the scale. B. T. K. The son of Sam. The Green River Killer. The Night Stalker. The Milwaukee Cannibal. The Coed Killer. The Plainfield Ghoul The Yorkshire Ripper The Rostov Ripper The Brooklyn Vampire The Candy Man The Monster of the Rivers The Vampire of Dusseldorf The Kindly Killer The Happy Face Killer The Gay Slayer The Vampire of Sacramento The Butcher Baker The Camden Ripper The Eyeball Killer On what street was the famous House of Horrors, where Fred and Rose West lived? Clement, Street Cromwell, Street Conduit, Street College, Street Who is believed to be America's first serial killer? Albert, Fish 
Howard, Alan. Danny, Barber. H. H. Holmes. Who partnered Carol Bundy in the Sunset Strip murders? Douglas, Clark. Leonard, Lake. Gerald, Gallego. Ray, Copeland. In what decade was the term serial killer first coined? The 1950s. The 1960s. The 1970s. The 1980s. How many murders was the Green River Killer convicted of? 28. 38. 48. 58. What ironic job did Ted Bundy have before and during his killing career? First aider. Hospital orderly. Suicide prevention hotline. Prison guard. Whose DNA was used to link the real killer behind the BTK killings? His mother's. His father's. His sons. His daughters. Which serial killer wrote, for heaven's sake, catch me before I kill more. I cannot control myself, on a victim's wall. William Herons. Kenneth Bianchi. David Berkowitz. Bobby Joe Long. Who was Jeffrey Dahmer's first victim? Curtis Strotter. Stephen Hicks. Oliver Lacey. Richard Guerrero. How many family members did Edmund Kemper kill? One. Two. Three. Four. Which serial killer drank animal's blood, believing it gave him special powers? Fred West. Gary Heidnick. Peter Sutcliffe. Richard Trenton Chase. How was Aileen Warnos executed? Electric chair. Lethal injection. Hanged. Firing squad. Which killer used sulfuric acid to dissolve the bodies of his victims? Dead Bundy. Henry Lee Lucas. John George Haig. Ian Brady. Which serial killer claimed he committed murder under the command of his neighbor's dog? Otis Toole. Jeffrey Dahmer. David Berkowitz. Herbert Mullen. Which of these was a serial killer doctor? Tony Abels. Michael Swango. Edward J. Adams. Quincy Allen. What is the nickname of serial killer Ted Kaczynski? Alligator Man. The Grim Sleeper. The Cleveland Torso Murderer. The Unabomber. During the 1980s, which killer couple was arrested by police after one was caught trying to steal a vice from a hardware store? Gwendolyn Graham and Catherine May Wood. Charles Starkweather and Carol Ann Fugati. Raymond Fernandez and Martha Beck. Charles Ng and Leonard Lake. How did serial killer Dean Coriel die? Shot by his accomplice. Killed in a car chase with police. Shot himself to evade capture. Shot by police. 
whose last words before execution were, turn up the radio, and I'll go quietly. Peter Manuel Dead Bundy John Wayne Gacy Richard Kuklinski Although never convicted of the crime, who is widely believed to have murdered his own brother as a child. Charles Manson Ed Gein Dennis Rader I take a little grass, a little LSD, but none of that was destructive. Anyway, you can ask any of them other girls that'll tell you that the other side of this game. Uh, I don't play. Uh, I don't play drugs. I play. I play light, light, you know, light, dibby dabby, chippy, and but I don't really get down heavy with it. The world has been fed many lies about me. Uh, I have read very few truths. Just a guy. Just a guy. What's going through my mind right now is to use the minutes and hours that I have left as fruitfully as possible and see what happens. Uh, it helps to, to live in the moment in the, in the essence that we use it productively. Killing, killing animals. Okay. Killing animals. Um, I stabbed a kid one time. Stabbed a kid with a knife. No, we, we don't discuss that because uh, it's been it's been uh, gone over so thoroughly in the papers and in the media that uh, uh, there's just really no point in, in going in depth. Those men were shot just, just shot in self defense. Boom, boom, boom. You know, they weren't cut up, they weren't sliced up, no OJ jazz, you know. And he said, I did the most horrendous crime in the whole wide world. Well, I'm not an expert. I'm not an authority. I'm someone who has been a murderer for almost 20 years. It would be a guess, but it's not, it's far more than 35. It isn't that impossible in this society. It happens. I got this fantasy. I started working out this fantasy in my mind. And once that potential, that person become a fantasy, I can just loop, loop it over. I lay in bed at night thinking about this person, uh, the events and how it's going to happen. And it become a real, almost like a picture show. started out very loving, very, uh, you know, typical. My memory is mostly a uh, few years of home movies and a lot of photographs. As we got older, though, and more of our personalities came out, uh, more and more it became my father's little disappointment. I was a king. I had everything I wanted, everything possible that, that a man could want, I had. I had money I didn't have before. I had a colored television I didn't have before. I had cable TV and I didn't have that before. I enjoyed entertaining kids. Like some people are, uh, you know, they, they unwind in different ways, either, either we're going out drinking or that. I could put on clown makeup and I was relaxed. A favorite? Well, most of the time, if you're up close, you shoot him under the chin. Shot a guy one time in his uh, Adam's apple. See how long it would take him to die. I'm a, what you call a power maniac. A power maniac can be uh, most anything, but I'm what you call a, a power maniac. And 
I took the leg, the right leg from that woman's body, from the knee to the hip, took the skin off, took the cords out, took the fat off, and I had crushed rock salt in my, one of my ammo pouches, and I sprinkled the water on it, and I'm staring at this other girl. The first time I did a shot of dope, it was the best feeling I ever had in my life. And the first time I killed somebody, it was such a rush. And it was just like that shot of dope. I don't make a big deal of it. I just consider it as part of my life now, part of, in a sense, part of my ministry. Uh, I get letters from people from all walks of life. Most people are sincere. Some are having, you know, very serious problems. He was a sacrifice. I was to murder three million people on planet Earth, and he was a sacrifice to see if I could murder one of my own. I mean, I. I... I agree with you, and I believe you up to a point. I mean, I'm not, it's not like I'm here expecting special treatment. I have no, I have no doubts about what my part is in all this. I'm just saying that, um, yeah, from what I've seen and from what my dealings are with him so far, I'm more inclined to put my faith in the things I've heard from them. Because my voices were talking to me, you need to make a sacrifice or we're going to come and get you. You need to do it. And I saw him, he was, where it was on, laying on the grass. Like, like that, it was like, like that. Just, just fast asleep, where he was drunk. Then he goes, he goes, he's the one, he's the one, he's the one. Do it, do it. Daniel, when I was, sometimes he's at the, he's at the, he deals, he hands out the drugs to uh, the guests. He might not be the same guy, I really don't know, but he's the only Daniel I know. Sharon, date. Charmaine, West. Leslie, Ann, Downey. Grace, Bud. Clarnell, Stage, Strandberg. Annie, Chapman. Regina, K. Walters. Josephine, Otero. Gianni, Versace. Yolanda, Washington. Kathleen, Grundy. Wendy, Lee, Caulfield. Bernice, Werden. Linda, Ann, Healy. Ricky, Beeks. Jean, Jordan. Jack, Blake. Betty, Lou, Jensen.
Lukas Slabosevsky. Larissa Kachenko. From Hell. Helter Skelter. Summer of Sam. The Boston Strangler. The Amityville Horror. Monster. The Iceman. The Deadly Tower. Henry, Portrait of a Serial Killer. Snowtown. Psycho. Wolf Creek. Den Rillington Place. The Deliberate Stranger. Citizen X. The Frozen Ground. To Catch a Killer. Appropriate Adult. Badlands. The Gray Man.
All the police are going to get me for, is running a funeral parlor without a license. Believe me, if I started murdering, there'd be none of you left. I robbed them, and I killed them, as cold as ice, and I would do it again. And I know I would kill another person, because I've hated humans for a long time. I choked her to death, then cut her in small pieces so I could take my meat to my rooms, cook, and eat it. How sweet and tender her little ass was roasted in the oven. It took me nine days to eat her entire body. After my head has been chopped off, will I still be able to hear, at least for a moment, the sound of my own blood gushing from my neck? That would be the best pleasure to end all pleasure. Hurry up, you Hoosier ba I could kill ten men while you're fooling around. If the blue meanies are going to get me, they'd better get off their asses, and do something. That is my ambition, to have killed more people, more helpless people, than any man or woman, who has ever lived. We serial killers are your sons, we are your husbands, we are everywhere. And there will be more of your children dead tomorrow. I did not know their names. I killed so many women, I have a hard time keeping them straight. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer, no more than the poet can help the inspiration to sing. Assassin? That sounds so exotic. I was just a murderer. The women I killed were filth bastard prostitutes, who were littering the streets. I was just cleaning up the place a bit. I took the right leg off that woman's body, from the knee to the hip, took the fat off, and ate it while she stared at the other girl. When I bit into it she just urinated right there. I remember there was actually a sexual thrill, you hear that little pop, and pull their heads off, and hold their heads up by the hair. Whipping their heads off, their body sitting there. That'd get me off. Sex is one of my downfalls. I get sex any way I can get it. If I have to force somebody to do it, I do. I rape them, I've done that. I've killed animals to have sex with them, and I've had sex while they're alive. My consuming lust was to experience their bodies. I viewed them as objects, as strangers. It is hard for me to believe a human being could have done what I've done. When this monster entered my brain, I will never know, but it is here to stay. How does one cure himself? I can't stop it, the monster goes on, and hurts me as well as society. Maybe you can stop him. I can't. I am beyond good and evil. I will be avenged. Lucifer dwells in us all. Well, you got me. How come it took you such a long time?
Thank you. 